Well, let's see here. Gonna do some digging. Try to get this grizz bed in the ground. So I can get some hay in there and get some uh, chicken poop and cow poop in there and mix it all up and get my garlic and my onions planted before the snow hits this weekend. Okay, so sit back and relax and watch me work. Yeah, it's probably easier with the shovel. But my knees ain't gonna let me do that, so I'm gonna do it with the hoe, and then we'll see how that goes. I have a real big shovel. Got a blue stem farm and ranch in Emporia, Kansas. $35. It really is sturdy. You can go, my husband goes, really digs like that. But that just tears, I have hernias, and that just tears my stomach up. So, I'll take it easy. Still get the job done, but just takes longer. <laughs> just because I have problems, don't mean I can't do stuff. I can't do a lot. But I'm doing what I can. That's only about two foot, and I think it's four foot. I have to get a little wider. Flies hanging around me. You think it's summer. Man, my hair is hanging down too. <laughs> if I can get the the four edges. Are you still wanting to be in the video, ball? Huh? If I can get the four edges for this raised bed to fit down in there, we'll get it moved in there. Yeah. You can help, Ball. Start digging over there. Yeah, where well, you won't be in the way from the hoe. So I think I only need like four or five inches deep. I don't need a deep, deep hole. Just big enough to get the, the bottom of the metal frame that's on the edges down inside the ground. So I think one more hole length should be enough on this side. Fair move. Paul, don't lay down there. I'm digging right there. Move, honey. Move. I'm going to dig. You're one brave little cat. <laughs> you going to move? Move, honey. I don't want to hurt you. Thank you. Thank you so much. It's such a beautiful day out for December the 9th. Wow. 60 something degrees today is supposed to be. It feels nice out here and no wind. Something to thank God for. Nice, beautiful weather to be working out here in the garden in December. <laughs> and not in a raised, not in a raised bed, not in a high tunnel or a greenhouse. Out in the open. In the spring and summer, if I'm out here working my butt off like I'm doing right now, 
I'll get a good heart rate. So let's see here. Gonna do some digging. Gotta get this grizz bed in the ground. So I can get some hay in there and get some uh, chicken poop and cow poop in there and mix it all up and get my garlic and my onions planted before the snow hits this weekend. Okay, so sit back and relax and watch me work. Yeah, it's probably easier with the shovel. My knees ain't gonna let me do that, so I'm gonna do it with the hoe, and then we'll see how that goes. I have a real big shovel. Got a blue stem farm and ranch in Emporia, Kansas. $35. It really is sturdy. You can go, my husband goes, really digs like that. But that just tears, I have hernias, and that just tears my stomach up. So, I'll take it easy. She'll get the job done, but it just takes longer. <laughs> Just because I have problems, don't mean I can't do stuff. I can't do a lot, but I'm doing what I can. That's only about two foot, and I think it's four foot. I have to get a little wider. Flies hanging around me. You think it's summer? Man, my hair is hanging down too. <laughs> if I can get the the four edges, are you still wanting to be in the video, ball? Huh? If I can get the four edges on another area, but. Sometime before the day's over, we'll be putting it in. I might make a, a video on that because I'm just doing the digging right now. Hopefully, I can get it done. I'll show you what I got done since it's probably getting to be a long video. I don't want to make it too long. Let's see here if I don't mess it up by picking it up. Ugh. Ball saying hi. You know ball. Got to be in every video. <laughs> see, here's ball. Say hi, ball. You going to say hi to everybody? Okay, well, here's where I dug the other day when I hurt my leg. And I used a shovel with it where the white pole is. And I used the pole to see if I can make a straight line. And it's about the same length as the raised bed. So, hope I don't have to do too much digging in here. Then I dug this just a little bit ago. Hopefully that's the width. And then I'm starting here. Here's the chicken poo right there. And the big dark pile is the cow poop. So that's why we're going to be mixing in the raised bed in the next few days. And you'll be able to see it. Anyway, I hope you like this video. Um, it's good exercise for me. And beautiful weather out. Why, why be inside in a nice warm house when you can be outside when it's nice and warm. And do something productive. <laughs> So, enjoy watching. Uh, I will finish this up as much as I can today. Hopefully, we can get it I can get it done and get the raised bed on. I'll show you filling it up. Show you planting the seeds or the bulbs, whatever. I hope it's not too late to plant my garlic because I'm still going to plant it. Uh, 
I guess I'll say ta-ta for now, and I'll see you tomorrow. Have a great day.